do the printer road, I'd say about 18 months ago. I was just looking for a way to get some indoor training in on the bike. I was looking at an Amazon review for a speed cadence sensor and stumbled across someone mentioning Trainer Road in one of the reviews for it. And so then I went over to the Trainer Road Red website and started checking it out. I was a little hesitant at first because one of the things that, that the industry tries to do a lot of the times is sucker you in on gear and training tools that you don't really need. You just need to go out and work hard. Um, but Trainer Road is absolutely not one of those things. Power meters are obviously expensive. That was out. And Trainer Road is really pretty spot on. When you factor in the, the hundreds upon hundreds of workouts that they have on the website and through the software, as well as the plans that they have set up that you can follow, you're really getting thousands of dollars of value out of something that's just a fraction of the cost of the power meter. When I first started using Trainer Road about 18 months ago, my best bike split for a 40k time trial was in a triathlon was an hour and 10 minutes. The 18 months of work that I put in on Trainer Road um, allowed me to take over 10 minutes off of my 40k bike split. And when I went to Adrian Nationals this last year, I went 59 and change. One thing I think is really important for a triathlete is if you want to be a strong runner, you've got to be a strong biker. So that was a big problem for me because I didn't have any bike strength at the beginning of training for triathlon, which was three years ago. I'd get onto the run and I just wouldn't have any strength left. So Trainer Road has not only taken a ton of time off my bike split, but it's also allowed me to have the strength that I needed to run really quickly. And so when I first started, I was running a 44 minute 10K the last race I just did, an open 10K, and I ran 37.13 for that one. So I know that the, the strength and the endurance is there now thanks to Train Road. The most I can train in a week is about 10 hours. And so I can't let biking eat up all that time with six or seven hours of biking. The most I can do is four or four and a half hours. And Train Road helps me accomplish that because of the efficiency and the benefit that you get out of each and every workout. You know, it's funny you ask, because my nutrition is actually a little unconventional compared to, I'd say, most 99% of endurance athletes. And I use honey. That's it. Raw honey. Um, and I find that it gives me everything I need. I use the honey in a 12% um, a ratio to water. Um, typically about four tablespoons for a 26 ounce bottle and that's perfect. It provides uh, right around 180 to 200 calories per hour. Um, yeah, it works really well. Honestly, I tell every single person, every single athlete, triathlete, cyclist that I know about Trainer Road because it's completely revolutionized the way that I bike. I've gone from being a back of the pack biker to being able to ride away from the field at the beginning. I, you know, if I come out of the water early, I just ride away from everybody. Um, the last uh, time trial I did in the local area, I averaged 26 and a half miles an hour. 18 months ago, I would have never dreamed of being able to bike that fast. I would have been happy with like a 21 or a 22 mile an hour bike. But now I'm out biking guys who have been biking for years and so I tell every athlete I know about it because it really does work. Fight another day.